Hello everybody and welcome. Today I'm gonna install macOS server Leopard on this lovely Power Mac G4 for a project that I have for creating a dial-up server to review my old Windows CE devices. As you can see, this machine looks perfect. I got it in a very good shape, no dust, nothing, and I haven't used it really much because at the time I also had the Duo 1.25 G4 that I used more. And I actually sold it because it had very X fans was, and I was not using it very much. But I kept this one just in case, and now it will come very handy. Here we have the entry option, the I think this is a Radeon 7300, if I'm not mistaken, we will see. Then you have the internal modem card, Duo 867GHz G4, and here we have, I think, 1.8 gigs of RAM. Back here I have a 64 gigs um, SSD connected to uh, ATA to serial 8 uh, adapter and here unfortunately they're called same damage let me take the phone to show you so this plastic I needed the I needed to use the optical disc on my first generation 1.1 Mac Pro and this is the only optical drive with parallel 8 that I have available but the power connector was here for so many years that I could not remove it without destroying the plug. No, not destroy, but I had to disconnect the wire from the plug and I will put it back later on. And of course, if you don't have it in the original position, you have always this extra wire here, which means that I cannot connect the shoot back. Well, it's not really necessary, and I don't have the machine on for so long. And the rest is original. At this point, I, I regret selling my Mac with Verex fans a bit, but I had gone through a bad breakup and I was emotionally damaged, so I got rid of everything not necessary. It was also a great machine, but, well, this is what I have now. It's super loud, but it works. Externally, the machine also looks impeccable. There are no scratches or anything anywhere. The front plate is glossy and flawless. The side panel looks very good too. The back is very clean and I don't think this Mac has, any, has ever seen any other expansion cards besides what's included. I have ordered from eBay a Radeon 9200, so I can try later MorphOS. Yesterday I tried burning two DVDs, nothing could boot. I also tried to boot the, booting the DVDs using VirtualBox. So let's see now if I manage by imaging the install to this external hard drive and booting via FireWire. Hopefully it should work. So. That didn't work either, so I must have here the worst setup ever for installing an operating system. The Mac Pro is booted in FireWire mode, so if you look here, yep. It's connected to the G4. The Mac OS installation CD is in the CD drive of the Mac Pro and it should be able to, you know, read through. And let's see if this now works. 